Gemini friends. Welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. So I'm going to do a love reading for you guys May 21st to May 31st, 2019. I know I missed the love monthlies for this month, but I wanted to get you guys something out. I've just been so busy. Um, those of you that don't follow me on Facebook or Instagram, I've taken on being a promoter for Thrive by LaBelle. I absolutely love it. Believe in it. Um, all I'll say about it is I do have a video up on my playlist. Those of you that are interested in trying Thrive, definitely check out the video. If you'd like a sample goodie bag, message me your name, your address, and I will get you out a sample goodie bag probably within the next month. Because I literally just got done doing at least 25 of them. So, Gemini, happy birthday. Those of you that are celebrating birthdays, I hope you guys have a fabulous birthday. Gemini, sun, moon, rising signs, in love. So, we are using, you guys have seen me use these before. I haven't used them in, the, in a while. The Psychic Tarot for the Heart. John Holland, and then I'll be pulling you an Oracle card, Whispers of Love, instead of the Romance Angels, getting sick of them, changing it up, this is a great deck for love, Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs, Gemini, okay, that's going to be your overall, I'm going to be pulling three cards, Sierra Marchetti's Gilded Reverie Lenormans. All right, the ship did flip up. I'm going to put it back. They're only right in the upright. Um, could be a time frame for some of you. Three days, three weeks, three months. Also, travel, going to see someone, them coming to see you. I'm definitely going on a journey. Okay, Gemini for the collective in love. What does Gemini need to know? Gemini for the collective. Okay, definitely that one. Gemini. Okay. Wow, that's um, like the Ace of Cups. And the Two of Cups. Wow, okay. Gemini, this is really pretty awesome. Okay. Listen to your heart. What is it asking you to do? Should you reach out your hand in friendship? Should you offer someone forgiveness? Make yourself more, more available? You could definitely, between now and the end of the month, those, you know, those of you that are single, you know, trust in your ability to create and maintain true love. You know, now is the time to make that happen. Now is the time for a new beginning. You know, and it's right here, too. You know, I just, it's the best card. It's just like the Two of Cups better in this deck. You know, it can represent your emotions. But, you know, these two swans, they're identical. And they and they form this beautiful heart. You know, it's just a very deep connection to someone. Like mind, body, and soul. You know, th this represents that two people are connected with this. Th these two people, you're connected with someone that's mind, body, and soul. Spiritual. There's a lot of light in both of these cards. 
Then you have actually the light coming through here. And, and, and you have a lot of messages here. Love is definitely on the way. It, this could even be the love of your life. You definitely have soulmate energy here. You know, this speaks, this was your first card out. This speaks about deep spiritual love. This is a deep connection with the romantic partner. You know, these two cards definitely back each other. And then, I mean, maybe this is someone that you work with too, with the fish. It could be someone that you work with. But keeping it on the love front, I mean, you could work with this person though, really. You know, especially those of you that are married, partnered, you know, financial discussions with maybe two sources of income, you know, but the birds are about a lot of communications, emails, text messages, communication. It's high energetic energy, you know, hectic flirting going on, good talking, you know, you could have lots of dates being asked out on lots of dates, having lots of conversations with more than one love interest. You know, I do feel like, you know, those of you that are with the, that are partnered and coupled, you're, you're with the person you're meant to be. And if you're, if you're meeting this person or just met this person, it's going to be a deep love and it's going to be a great spiritual connection. It really is absolutely beautiful. I want to, I'm just curious and it's your birthday. Let me see what this two of cups, the swans is. What is this? I definitely this. Get out of here. Well, for many of you, it's a man. I'm going to get another card. What's the birds? Communication. What is all that? Gemini. Okay. Wow. God, talk about having every good card in the deck. This is going to bring you a lot of happiness. This person is bringing you a lot of happiness. Some of you could be, those of you that are coupled, maybe traveling. If you're traveling together, like say as business partners, because this definitely could be a business partner connection. You work, guys work together and you have to do like, you know, like a week, like a weekend business meeting, travel business meeting. You're going to fall in love with this. You two are going to fall in love. I don't know who this reading is for, but it is flipping and beautiful. Truth, clarity. This person's on the up and up. You could totally. And that's a 10. This person wants a new beginning. They're, they, they're definitely wanting this new beginning. Just realize that now. They're at a 8 and 2. That's 10. They're completing a cycle. Oh, beautiful. And if you're the man that's offering this, you're special. Like, really. And it's going to be reciprocated. Okay, definitely this one. And, you know, you could be dealing with Scorpio Cancer Pisces. It's probably a Scorpio Cancer Pisces male. Oh my God, spiritual connection. People, I can't make this up. This relationship has a connection that goes beyond this lifetime. Yeah. It'll be very successful. Damn. What a reading, Gemini. Happy birthday. That's definitely... I mean, this card is says the same thing. It's, it's, it's definitely a spiritual and deep love, soulmate connection. Beautiful. Happy birthday. Love you guys.
If you follow me on Facebook, I will see you guys Wednesday. Those of you that do not, I will see you guys back here soon with your June monthlies. Take care, guys.